Hello, I'm Richard Vobes, the bald explorer, out on another walk on a beautiful, sunny... Wait, hang on. I seem to have lost the country. I'm somewhere else. I need help. Wait, there's, there's Matthew Holdsworth and his son, Josh. Hello, Matthew. Hi, Richard. Hello, Josh. Hello. How are you? Good. You're good? Can you tell me where we are? Uh, on a path near the Stepping Stones. Ah. In Box Hill. In Box Hill. Where's yes. Box Hill, Matthew? Uh, just outside Dorking, in Surrey. Ah, oh, right. Yes, I knew I'd somewhere. Mm. I know I look a bit different. I've got a raincoat on. It's not even mine. No. Uh, that's because we've had miserable weather today. It's been awful. But I've even got wellies on and everything. I have. Look at this. He's got wellies on. Wellies. We've all got wellies. wellies, wellies, wellies. And look, there's the lovely Julia with the new hairstyle. Uh, wait, that's not a new bear normal. style. Oh, a new bear style. And who's this little fella next to you? It's my bear twin. Ah, uh, is that little Elijah? It is. Mark is on the gin, I noticed. So <laughs> we're going to the stepping stones. Yes. So um, what are the stepping stones? Um, well, it used to be a ford there across the river, and now it's a footpath. It was put in um, in the 30s, and it uh, crosses the uh, River Mole. Oh, well, I'm very excited. Mm. Um, are you going to lead the way, Josh? Uh, Which way yeah. is it? Which way should we go? That way. Yes. That way. That way. Let's, Let's go. go. So these big hills that are covered in wonderful trees, Matthew, what are yes. they? Where is this? Uh, that is Box Hill. That and box Hill. most of the trees that you see, the sort of greeny, yellowy ones, yeah. are uh, box. The box, the actual box trees? They are box trees. trees, yes. Wow. Well, there seems to be a whole variety of other trees that we've noticed as we've approached, but I'm very impressed by these amazing trees. And of course, a lot of people come here, don't they, to go they up. Is this part of the um, North Downs? Yes, it is. Yes, this is a, this is a chalk. Chalk Hill, you can see the chalk just, just about, about get glimpses of there. chalk, yeah. Yes, so if you followed the followed it round, it would go round to um, the quarries at Betchworth and then on to Collie Hill and Rygate Hill. And of course, I've been to Betchworth a few times, you I? have, yes. And uh, what with yourself and with, um, Mark, with English. Mark English, yes, yes, in this sort of neck of the wood. Well, I'm very excited to see the stepping stones, and I gather that one of us is going to go paddling, uh, yes. Is yeah. it you? It's not me. Oh, is it y you, Julia? Too no. cold for me. Josh, uh, I mean, um, Elijah. Elijah? No. That leaves one person who might be going paddling. Uh, wait a minute, somebody's got bare legs, look. Is it you? Yes. Yes. How deep is the river mole where the stepping stones are? Not that deep. Not that deep? Oh, good. So you won't, you won't disappear then? No. No. I hope not. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, right. You will have to go in. I will. Yeah. Brilliant. Well, let's, uh, let's crack on and see these wonderful stepping stones. We've just paused because we've seen... Amazing plane tree. A London plane. A London plane. Have a look at this. Um, I'll get a wide view in a second, but I just want to take you inside. A, it's an absolute beautiful plane all on its own in the middle of this field. And there is this amazing trunk beautiful trunk but what is astounding apart from its natural beauty is here we are look josh has picked up some stuff to show us the bark comes off as we know as a london plane does but look at the size of the bark it's just scattered about that's an amazing piece it's like faux leather on the inside to look at it the texture of it looks just like a leather yeah. at the inside of leather Left. You've got some? I've just got a little bit in there, but there's loads of it all it's over. It's just all out on the floor. It's just stripped off the branches. And then you can see the branches. It's so natural. Here they are, just lying out here, stripped off. And I wonder if part of that is because we've had such heat that it's sort of coming off quicker than no, I've ever seen it stripped down like this and the, the bark lying around. But anyway, just thought we'd, we'd stop and have a look at this. And if it rains again, this is certainly the place to come, isn't it? This really is the place to I come. I think this tree, I mean, it's just, A, it's, it's so huge. It's just so huge and, and, and in full leaf, which is terrific. I love it. Let's get a shot of it, because it's sitting here in this field, all on its own. And as we walk away towards the little bridge, we should get a great view behind us of this tree and these amazing, amazing leaves. And, and it has 
it's got the fruit actually yes just have a quick look here it has got the fruit just growing just beginning to grow I don't know if you can see that just trying to get the camera there there it is anyway let's take a little stroll I'm a bit laden up with haversacks and camera bags and then have a look behind us and if I step out the way you'll get a better view looks like we come to a footbridge Julia it looks like it as this goes across the river I'm guessing uh, yes it does we need to go across here and uh, this is uh, in case you can't use the stepping stones really oh see right it's meant to make life a bit easier I think we're very close to the North Downs way as well which comes along down here so I think this is one of the offshoots of it so for the people to take uh, Josh has got a sign there what does what does the sign say Josh it says stepping stones footbridge erected June 1992 ah not too uh, not too long but I'm guessing before you were born Josh it was before he was born yes I was only 11 then ah <laughs> were you yes I was sadly a bit older <laughs> So oh, over we go, over the river, we look yeah, down here. Amazing roots just down there on that tree. Wait, I'm, lo I'm looking the wrong way. And I think we're, this is a, yeah, I'm definitely looking a sweet, the wrong way. Uh, sweet chestnut, horse chestnut horse tree. Chestnut, yes. And it's, uh, has that got this little canker? Yes, that's the canker in it. It's the uh, little yellow and brown discoloration. I think it's some kind of little beetle or bug that eats inside the leaves. Yeah, that's a real, sh it's a it real is. shame, isn't it? It is, yeah. It, and, it, and we've seen some recently as we were driving around up to the Mortimer Forest that were all brown. Yes, it I just think they look very bad. It, it doesn't seem to be affecting the health of them though. They're still growing conkers and things. It hasn't made them unsafe. So right. I'm hoping that'll continue. Just makes them look a bit sad come mid-August. Yeah, yeah, no, they, they look like they've gone into autumn already. They do. And here's the other side of the river behind us here, winding its way around. But it's the stepping stones we're looking for. Yes. Are you ready for that? Yeah. Yeah. This is a very uh, beautiful walk and a little bit of nature with all the different species of uh, trees and no doubt lots of wildlife in here as well. Yes, we're only about uh, we're under a mile actually from Dorking as well. So I know it's, it's incredible and people go on the A24 as I do up and mm. down to London and beyond and you pass this without even knowing it's here. I hadn't been here uh, before May. I knew there were stepping stones, but I didn't know where they were. And do you know why they're there? Um, they're there for, it used to be an ancient ford and oh, they were right. crossed in the 1930s, they built them. And then they took them away in the Second World War um, and replaced them in 1946. And they were opened by Clement Attlee. Oh, wow. And they've been there ever since. It's very clear, isn't it? It's um, very, yeah, very it's, it is a very clear river, um, you can see. Uh, and uh, and pretty shallow at the moment as well. I believe we have arrived. We have arrived at the stepping stones. At the stepping stones. Yes. And they're just down here on our right. They are indeed. If we come round here, you'll just see them. Just got to climb down this little bank, which is wet now with clay. And they do actually cross the the th the thing, the river. <laughs> By thing, I mean river and yes. it looks like the boys are wading they are and josh through the river josh has a tree we've lost we've lost the other one <laughs> and he's, um, elijah's just hiding oh elijah's hiding oh i see so here's the stepping stones oh and they do go right across so uh, let's have a demonstration there he is matthew no fear and the lovely Julia. Stuck, no fit. No. Oh, I thought you were falling in then, Julia. Cleaning my boots. Cleaning the boots. And I'm going to attempt to go over. One. That is Max Two. Going over another one. Three. This is fun. I'm enjoying it, but uh, I don't want to uh, fall in. And. As you may or may not know, I've only got one eye, so I have to just be a bit careful about how I step because it's very easy to misjudge by inches, enough to trip yourself over. I'm halfway through and the river goes on. We've seen some amazing trees en route, 
some a fig tree and uh, what was that other one? Slows, slows. slows. slows yes. We're under, um, I think we're under another horse chestnut. Under a horse chestnut? Yeah. There we are, look, I've made it without falling in. Famous last words, but there we go. Well done. Dad. Holding the camera and everything. <laughs> yes. I have a problem. Where I found the treasure, it's treasure. actually... Oh yes, what did you find in there the other day, Josh? Oh yeah, the other day I found like part of a cup, kind of. It was the Holy Grail. It was a clay jar, part of a clay jar. We think it was uh, may have held some rum. Oh, ah, uh, not, yes. not the Holy Grail. Not the Holy Grail, no. Not oh, this what time, a shame. I'm afraid. Oh dear. Oh well, not to worry. Well, there we are. We didn't have to pay anybody to get across. Nope. Like you know, you may have had to pay somebody well, a right. toll to get across. Yeah. What Once did you think, Julia? It was awesome. You had fun? Yeah. You've been wading in the water? Yep. Not this bit though. Oh, uh, Elijah's gone flying back. There he goes. Hey ho. Well, he came across through the water. Oh yes, wading. that's true. Anyway, yeah, thank you so it. much for no taking problem. us. It's been an absolute joy. Yeah, no, it's a lovely walk. So if you ever get the chance to come down and have a look, then uh, do so. It's easy to find. Yep. Nip off the A24 at Box Hill and away you go. Absolutely. Yep. Brill. We've got to cross this back or is there a shortcut? We're going to have to cross back again, I'm afraid. Uh, then we can go to the pub. We can. Yeah. Yeah. Until next time, bye for now. Bye. bye.